Hello everybody, my name is James Messelson. I'm a bass instructor here at Arc Music in Boca Raton, Florida. A little about myself, I've been playing professionally for about 20 years. I've been in a couple of signed bands, uh, a band called Boiler Room on Roadrunner Records, then Tommy Boy Records. We had uh, put an album out, we did some tours with bands like Disturbed, Nonpoint, Typo Negative, Slipknot, did some shows with them. Um, when you come to Arc Music, if you're a beginner bass player, the first thing I'd really like to work on would be technique. Without technique, you're really not going to get too far in the band. I mean, you could uh, be Beethoven in your head, but you have to apply real-world technique with your fingers. So the first thing we'll do, we'll do some finger exercises, working your right and left hands. Here's an exercise that I like to show uh, students when they first come in. I call it a chromatic exercise. Check it out. does is it gets all your fingers moving on both hands. You're rotating your fingers, you're using your first, second, third, fourth finger on your left hand, strengthening your pinky, um, you're implying muting techniques with your thumb, bringing your thumb down so no strings ring out. Being a clean bass player is more important than being a fast bass player. And uh, so those are some of the things that I, I like to show a beginner. Um, a more advanced technique might be a slapping technique. And I'll give you a little example of how I like to uh, go about teaching that. Check this out. Put a little beat on here. And here we go. That's a more advanced technique, but the way I go about teaching, if you want to start slapping, if you haven't slapped before, is we just pop octaves, meaning we pop a low E and a high E. Thump, slap, thump, slap, thump, slap, thump, slap. Then what we do is we add a dead note. A dead note is you're hitting the bass, but no note is coming out like this. So check this out. Next thing we could do is, if you want to get into a little bit more advanced technique even, we could do some jazz blues for a more advanced bass player. We could do stuff like this. Stuff like that, we're applying the major scale, the minor scale, we're augmenting notes, diminishing notes, and that's more advanced stuff that we could get into once you've been here for a few years or for a few months or just come in and check us out. Um, another thing, maybe you want to learn some old school metal, some Iron Maiden. Get your fingers moving really fast, something like this. here at Arc Music with bass playing. Um, if you want to learn some soloing, we could try that. Check this out. There's our drummer again, and he's great because we don't have to pay him. He's free. Check this out. Like I said, all levels, all styles, no matter what you want to do, we don't pressure you. Learn at your own pace. We just want to have some fun, teach you some bass. And for anybody who says that bass is easier than guitar, it's just simply not true. It really depends how far you take the bass. So many styles and techniques, it's endless. Hope to see you here. Thank you.